story. In a little less than an hour, 50-year-old Franco Navarrete faces 50 to 95 years in prison for killing his wife's mother and brother in 2017. He shot them outside a home on Eastwich Drive in Lafayette. News 18's Kayla Sullivan is live at the courthouse today. She's covered the trial since January, and now she'll be there as he is sentenced. Trevor, I was also there the morning of the shooting in August of 2017. A neighbor ran out and tried to save the two victims, but she was unable to do so because their shootings were so severe. Now, I went back today to see how she was doing, and she said she's still pretty traumatized from what happened. She didn't want to go on camera with me today, but she did show me a memorial that's still there in her yard where it happened. She says the family likes to lay flowers and crosses here throughout the year to honor Catalina. Cumpanzano Luano and Gustavo Sanchez Cumpanzano. A jury convicted Franco Navarrete for their murders. During the trial, witnesses, DNA, ballistic, and digital evidence put Navarrete's gun, car, and phone at the scene of the shootings. Though prosecutors aren't required to prove a motive, they did provide texts and witness statements to show Navarrete did not get along with the victims. After the murders, Navarrete wrote a letter apologizing to his daughter and God for his, quote, horrific acts. He also called 911 and said he needed to go to jail nine hours after the shooting. Well, Navarrete's sentencing starts at 1 p.m. today, and I'll bring you the results online at WLFI.com and tonight on News 18 at 5 and 6. For now, reporting live at the Tippecanoe County Courthouse, Kayla Sullivan, News 18.